Until the end of the last century, scientists believed that Earth had been shaped from within for millions of years. As a young mining engineer, Daniel Moreau Barringer challenged the scientific philosophy of his day, and by doing so, gave birth to an entirely new field of science. Barringer graduated from Princeton University in 1879 at the age of 19, and from the University of Pennsylvania Law School by the time he was 21. He went on to study geology at Harvard and mineralogy at the University of Virginia. Barringer heard of a giant crater in the barren landscape of northern Arizona. When he finally arrived at the site, he instantly understood that it had been made by the impact of a meteorite from outer space. Confident that the meteoritic material still lay beneath the surface of the crater, Barringer began drilling in hopes of mining the iron ore that he believed lay hidden beneath the crater floor. Receiving little support from geologists, he remained steadfast and determined for another 26 years. To prove his theory, Barringer invested the fortune he had recently made from a successful silver mine into unearthing the meteorite mass, as his finances steadily declined. The magnificent house that Barringer had built for Margaret and their eight children in Wayne had to be sold. The large family moved repeatedly to a series of rented houses along the main line. In 1921, his 12-year-old son Richard published an article in the prominent journal Popular Astronomy entitled An Argument on the Origins of Lunar Craters. His father drew encouragement from this article for the rest of his life, a simple act of parental love that continues to send shockwaves throughout the world of science today.
Finally, in 1929, a group of prominent astronomers demonstrated that the meteoritic mass that Barringer had been seeking had exploded and vaporized upon impact. The verdict destroyed Barringer's dream. Within a week, he was dead of a heart attack. Three more decades would pass before the scientific community finally accepted the fact that Barringer had been correct about the crater's origin. Daniel Moreau Barringer's legacy is the creation of a unique field of science that explores meteorites, asteroids, comets, impact craters, and the origin and history of the solar system. Only in the past few decades have scientists understood that meteorites may well be the original vehicle for life on Earth. Barringer's descendants formed the Barringer Crater Company to actively promote the science of meteoritics and to maintain the meteor crater in Arizona as a memorial to his pioneering achievement. <laughs>